So greetings, it's Mike from LiveMyAssUp.com. I just landed in Boston, Boston's Logan Airport. And I'm outside and I got my luggage in probably, I'm gonna say six minutes. Um, very quick for JetBlue. Last time I was here, it took forever. I'm gonna be getting on that. Oh, I'm sorry, I missed it. Uh, what I wanted to show you was the water shuttle, which is basically a bus. Uh, it takes me over to the um, MBTA boat that goes to uh, one, of the, one of the places it goes to is Hull. The other one is Hingham. Um, there you go. Water shuttle. Two minutes. Um, and then I think it's like $18 or $15 or whatever. It's nothing. Um, and then I'll take the boat to Hingham. And then my folks will pick me up. And then I think we'll either go for, it's a little cloudy right now, but I think we'll go for a walk. I haven't decided yet. Um, I'm actually not really that tired, even though I only got like three or four hours of sleep last night. I came in from DC. I was down there for a, uh, for a conference, um, the Nutanix.next conference, which was awesome. And I was down there with the, um, with the Converge user group. So that was really exciting. Um, we had a great show. And, uh, and thank you to Nutanix for anyone who watches this. Um, I know there are also some Dell EMC guys that watch this, so thank you. Hope you live in the dream. Um, anyway, so this is going to be cool. I haven't been home since last May. Um, and at that time I was here for a, a customer advisory board meeting through, at the time, uh, BCE, uh, which then became Dell, which, no, sorry, which then became EMC, which then became Dell EMC, which it is now. So. Um, Anyway, it's good to be back, uh, and I'm back later, which means it's going to be hot and humid, which I'm totally excited about. Um, I'll show you guys a little bit about where I grew up, about uh, this place called World's End. I'll show you some uh, pictures of the beaches that my folks go to and walk every morning. So it's going to be awesome. I'm psyched to be back here. I'm psyched to be back here for July 4th. Um, my hometown practices July 4th pretty well. It's, it's, it's pretty cool. It's a bunch of families and stuff downtown. Uh, and in fact, they even paint the yellow lines that are down the middle of the road. They even paint them red, white, and blue. So it's kind of cool. So anyway, it's Mike's with my ass off.com saying, I hope you're living the dream. So if you're not living the dream, you have probably not been to Boston around July 4th. It's fun. Ciao. Okay, so there you go. That's cool. I'm now at the water transportation waiting area. Um, bus comes in from there, does a little circle drops me off here. I've actually been here before. You buy your tickets on the boat. Uh, a little waiting area here, which is kind of cool. It's a little bit of spitting rain. And you basically catch the boat here. Um, I can wait inside, though, for the boat. Um, I think the boat comes at, I want to say 10.50 or something like that. Um, it'll come and then goes all the way to the South Shore. So that'll be pretty awesome. Um, I think it's been over two years since I've taken this boat, but it's really rad. And uh, yeah, so that'll be pretty cool. I wonder how. That's a pretty sweet gig. It's Aloha. That was pretty cool. You know, she's at her own private boat. That's pretty sweet. But anyway, um, oh yeah, so here you go. So basically, I'm over here at Logan, um, and the boat's gonna go all the way down to Hingham and Hull. I'll try to. Um, I'm going to hang them. I'll try to give a uh, throw a map in here of uh, where I'm going. So, yeah, so that's pretty cool. It's like I'm the only one here. That's the interesting thing about. Oh yeah, that's right. It's a weekday. So basically, everyone came in this morning, um, and, uh, and now they're leaving. So, there you go. Um, I don't know why that lady is doing that. That's like kind of cool. Huh, let's find out what she's doing. So that's pretty sweet, right? So there are these little water taxis here, and they go over to Rose Wharf, which is basically over there. So it's simply like across the harbor. Basically, this gig right here, Rose Wharf is there, so it basically just goes from there to there. Um, so you can get to like downtown Boston, because of course, if you have to go all the way around, and you're sitting in traffic. Although, to be fair, at this time of day, weekday, it's like 10, there's not that much, but that's pretty cool. Oh, and they're all electric, right? So that's kind of neat. Um, but anyway, yeah, so that's simply this thing right here. And uh, it goes over there, over there. So that's 
pretty good. The hang about comes, it's a big one. Um, I would be very, is there, is there anyone inside? Because it's like kind of spitting right here. I don't see anybody. Um, it's windy, but it's actually kind of, it's, you know, it's warm enough for me. Um, I always like it warmer. Um, but you know, I've got like a sweatshirt, my hoodie on. And uh, so yeah, I can't remember our, I'm trying to find the schedules. But it doesn't matter, basically I'm waiting here until the boat comes and then I will get on that one. Um, so that'll be, that'll be good. Let me see if they have, I mean, I can show you a PDF actually of the schedule for the boats. Um, I'm trying to think of this, uh, oh no, this just shows you where the airlines were. So basically, um, we are, uh, I took it from there. Um, I'm sorry, I took it from there. I was in Terminal C, uh, and then I'm now here at the water transportation boat dock. So, uh, this whole ride from here to there, sorry, there, there, um, I don't know, um, 10 minutes, whatever. Um, the roads that it goes on could be subject to traffic depending upon the time of day, but again, this is, <coughs> this is super convenient um, this time right here. So, I'm gonna grab my bags because it is starting to rainish a little, but the good news is the air temperature is warm. The high is supposed to be like 86 or 89 today, I think. Probably a little cooler in Hingham, it's probably about 85, but yeah. So yeah, it's raining a little bit. I don't know if you can see that, so. It's okay. Good news is, like my dad always says, I'm waterproof. So anyway, right on. And rain.